Hey everyone, so today I didn't go to class again. Um, I ended up accidentally setting the wrong alarm when I reset it and didn't wake up until 8.15 and so, I mean I could have made it to class but I decided today was really the last day that I could even take off at all and next week is going to be heinous so I decided to just take off a day for personal health. So I slept until 2. That was good. Um, there was another earthquake, and it woke me up at, like, 11.30. So, like, I just woke up, and I turned on the TV, and then I went back to sleep. Um, but, yeah, I slept until 2. That's not wonderful. Um, so, anyway, then um, I was debating, like, for hours, where should I go? But then the Boys of Flowers kind of finale is, like, episode 25 came on. So then I was watching that, and then I got distracted because they started playing... Um, Mew, Mew, Gyu, Mew, Gyu, Helper. Uh, it has like Kusanagi from SMAP and it has Kuroki Mesa um, and Yamamoto Yusuke and Kota Yabu. So I decided to watch that and it was like the first episode. So then I watched that and then it was like five o'clock and I was like, okay, maybe I'm not going anywhere today. Uh, so I just ended up walking around Sun Street. I went to the pet store like always. I go there like three times a week. And I mean, I'm gonna leave next week, so I won't be able to go shopping around here anymore because it's kind of out of the way. So yeah, I went to I went to Sun Street and I went shopping. Um, and I got milk tea that was really expensive. Um, it was like peach milk flavor. It was really good, but really expensive. And they didn't actually like fill the thing up all the way, so that was kind of. And then I went and bought dinner. I'm having karage and rice right now. And they had curry on sale, so I bought some curry for the next couple days. Um, hopefully I'll do something fun tomorrow, though. It is the weekend-ish. I should have gone to karaoke today earlier, but I didn't. Um, and I'm, like, running out of money. Yeah, I mean, the whole thing right now is, like, I'd love to go out and go to places right now. But I don't know what I'm getting my scholarship now. Because I thought we were getting it maybe, like, by the 15th. I thought we were turning in our bank account information by the 10th, so hopefully we'd start getting it by the mid-month time. But then I got an email saying that a lot of people who are getting the scholarship, a lot of the other study abroad students who didn't do this summer program, are coming like right now and picking up their alien reg cards and stuff like that, so they're not even ready to start getting their scholarships yet, which means that we're not going to get them yet either. So we're probably not going to get them until end of September, which is sucks because we move in next week so I don't have money to pay my my $200 maintenance fee that you have to pay when you move in I don't have money to start furnishing my apartment or anything like that until the end of September so I'm kind of screwed <laughs> like I'm lucky that I brought over so much money for my savings but I'm down to like 1300 right now and I started with 2500 and the exchange rate's horrible, so I don't want to, like, keep exchanging money. I want my scholarship. So, yeah. The fact that they're making us wait this long is really preventing me from, like, doing other stuff because I'm so strapped for money right now. So, yeah. Hopefully, it doesn't take a super long time to get it. But, I mean, I'm going to have to pay for my phone next week. I have to pay for the delivery service for my luggage because I can't lug my stuff to my new apartment. It's, like an hour away by train and like train platforms are all stairs and it'd be impossible to carry that much luggage with me so I have to send it through a delivery service pay like 20 bucks per bag or something because they're both pretty big so I gotta pay for that and then you know pay for my new transportation um, between school and um, my dorm because it's like 45 minutes 30 minutes by train I think 15 minutes walking so I'm going to have to pay for that. And my commuter pass ran out um, a couple days ago. So I have to start paying to get to Akihabara for, for school every day. Uh, luckily, that'll be over on Thursday, but still. It's like $3 a day. Um, so yeah, money sucks. Like, I like, even though I got these scholarships, I still feel, like, pressured to save money and pressured to, like, not go overboard and always, like, strap for, for money. So... I don't know, I just don't, I don't catch a break here. <laughs> like, I mean, I thought, you know, getting the scholarships would mean I would be able to kind of, like, spend money more freely, go do more stuff that I want to do. 
But really, since I'm waiting so long to get this JASO scholarship, and my first scholarship went straight to paying towards uh, tuition and the, the summer pro um, program, I pretty much don't have any extra money right now. I have less money, so that's not good. I, I guess I got a little too dependent on the scholarship coming in sooner, and now that it's not, the fact that I have to pay for like all this moving in stuff myself is lame. But yeah, I'm going to go finish eating dinner. And I guess I'm not really going to do anything the rest of the night. Maybe I'll just go hang out with people in their rooms or something. Um, but yeah, we'll see.